circuit is, it's it's a bit of a tricky circuit. Um, if it's moist and they've ripped it pretty deep, the track can get quite rutted and it's it's very tacky. But you know, if it dries out a little bit, it, it gets a little bit of a blue groove uh, top top soil. You know, it's quite really compact and really hard. So it's it's a little bit tricky compared to the tracks overseas, which are always wet and very rough and things like that, and, and generally rip pretty deep. So there's a lot of ruts. Uh, but it should should make for some really good racing. We've had some good races here in the past. Yeah, mud races in SA are far and few between. Um, I can't even remember the last one. Actually, you know, I think the last one was here yeah, about two, three years ago. Um, I love the track. A lot of guys didn't enjoy it too much, but uh, you know, the track is a lot of fun. I think when it gets wet and it's it's grippy and it's and it's slippery at the same time. I know that doesn't make sense, but yeah, if you ride, you'll understand. Um, it's very different. This track, this track is. is um, it can, it can get quite tight um, in some parts of the track, whereas the GP tracks are a lot more flowing. Of um, some tracks are a little bit tight, but not not as tight as this. This track has got a few really tight sections. It makes it a little bit one line, but at the same time, it makes for close racing because um, it's not too technical. The guys tend to bunch up in those sections. So, you know, from that aspect, it's it's quite different. The, the GP tracks are a lot quicker than what, than what we raced into this weekend. Um, it's pretty. It's pretty difficult with, with work and, and things like that during the week. Um, so you kind of try to sneak in a ride or, or whatever whenever you can. And uh, you know, a lot of my training is, is high intensity but short time span because I don't have a lot of time to play with during the week. So um, you know, it, it depends a little bit on, on how the day is planned with work. But generally, it's an, it's an early start, five o'clock start, and you know, we finish generally seven o'clock at night. So it's quite a long day.